Good morning, good morning, good morning peeps. I'm here today at the Sky Rail in Cairns, uh, about to pop on a, a train to Coranda. Got the gold class train ride. I'm gonna be taking a sky, sky rail back down and that was the diamond view. The tickets cost about 180 for the upgraded version. So let's go. So you take the bus, it takes about 10 minutes, it gets you to the Karanda Scenic Railway Station in Freshwater. There's a gift shop, there's refreshments, there's toilets, and you're just gonna hang here and wait for the train. And that's, I guess, what gold class gets you, you, isn't it? All the rest is yet to come when you get Oh, the is that right? <laughs> so we just checked in to our little wee Miranda station, part of the gold class as we get ourselves a pre mocktail and the best is yet to come apparently. Gold class, baby. Oh. Oh. Now the gold class menu I just handed to you, all you have to do is choose the drinks and the rest we will bring to you. No. I will be coming around here to drink for very shortly. Okay. okay. Falls look out. The train stops here for 10 minutes. I'm gonna grab ourselves a shot of the uh, waterfall and then we'll be popping back down with the train. All right, let's go. This is the non gold class. So there's a difference in the seating, but same, same. And this one here is how it is the gold class so i would recommend the upgrade to the gold class carriage where you can sit back relax obviously get served food and beverages don't expect aircon the aircon comes from the open windows uh, the train journey takes about an hour and a half and don't forget the hot tip is make sure if you're traveling to Granda sit on the right hand side of the train because that's where you'll get the most awesomest views so we just finished our train journey. We're here at Coranda. This is the map. The train actually did stop at Barron Falls, but if you're up to a little bit of a hike, it's a 3.5 kilometre walk back down to Barron Falls. But look, in this weltering heat, I would suggest you just stop for the 10 minutes on the train journey and maybe come down and check out the uh, Coranda village, which is what we're gonna do. So let's go. So it's like a 10 minute walk apparently to the village. Welcome to Karanda. Beautiful street. Little wee knick-knack shops, souvenir shops. Gee. So it's a bit of a hike to get up to the Karanda Visitor Centre. We've um, tackled that 30 plus degree heat. Um, we've made it to the Butterfly Sanctuary or the Butterfly 
pavilion. We might just go and check that out because we've got a couple of hours here. So let's go. Open 9.30 to 3.30, the Australian Butterfly Sanctuary. An even park, watch your step, Mum. How many butterflies in the sanctuary? Like 39,000 or 16,000. Who's who in the Avery? So there's obviously quite a lot. Oh look, he's just like landed on me. This little sucker just landed on me. Look. Yeah, it just landed on me. Oh. So Coranda's Butterfly Sanctuary. It is Australia's largest butterfly Avery. Correction, I may have got the 16,000 butterflies wrong. It was an absolute scorcher inside the Avery but it was definitely worth the visit. Okay, so I think our journey's come to an end. Oh, that's nice. Oh my God, that is so nice and refreshing. Ooh, it is so nice. So I just finished at the Butterfly Sanctuary for 20 bucks. I thought it was quite good value. There was apparently 16,000 butterflies there. So if you're a photographer like me, um, yeah, you can get your uh, photography skills happening. Uh, it's starting to twinkle with some rain, which is much needed after the 32 degree humid weather here. We've got to take ourselves back to the sky rail because we'll be catching the sky rail back down. I like this sign, don't panic, seven minutes, easy walk to the train and the sky rail, yep. So we made it back to the Skull Rail. So this morning we popped up on the train to Coranda, been up and checked out the Butterfly Sanctuary. We're now here at the uh, Sky Rail Cableway and we're about to uh, head our 2.15 departure. So let's go. So there's two stops here. Yes. So they're involved and then there's another one. And they're right there. The first stations will have a wheelchair tomorrow. Thank you. Oh, this one. Oh. Oh. So as part of our ticket we got the Sky Diamond class and the reason we got that is because of this. There's a nice breeze coming from down here so it's actually nice and refreshing even though it's probably like 32 degrees outside. But yeah, this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. And we've got the diamond view because you can actually see just straight underneath. It's a bit spinny. We're going to be getting off at our first pit stop, which is Baron Falls. Cool. Oh. <laughs> so on the Sky Rail, we stopped at the first stop. And we're going to have a look at the Edge Lookout. So, this way it is. There's kind of like perfect timing to get the train because it's not always there, is it? No. Let's just go this way. Oh, the waterfalls might be better here. The uh, Baron Falls here, Coranda. It's like a roller coaster. I'm getting ready for a roller coaster. Okay. Oh. Oh. Jesus. Oh yeah. No, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> okay, that wasn't too bad. Not like the first one. So we just got off at Baron Falls. And the hot tip for you, if you time it right, you could actually catch it whilst the train is actually at that station. Um, because we caught around the two o'clock sky rail, so the train was over there. So time it right, you might spot the train. So we got off at the sky rail on stop number two. I wouldn't say it's anything to rave about. There's one little lookout up there, not very good. But then we have this little wee, I don't know, it's a jungle, 
song, birds, animals, avatar, a little bit of a history lesson, or if you want to uh, know about a little bit about these animals, then yes, you can stop here. But we're on to our last stop for the day, and that is back to our starting location this morning. come to an end I hope you have enjoyed this video uh, if you have give me a like and a thumbs up why don't you subscribe to my channel and comment below if you've got anything you want to know um, so as usual peeps uh, I'll spot you in the next video booyah <laughs>